think we should. Okay, that's better. Okay, so it's time to make a update video about these um, MagSafe phone holders that I made. Um, this is the first version that you have uh, maybe seen the, the video on this one, the demo. Um, if you haven't, I'll put a card on the screen so you can check this one out after. Uh, but it's been some time now and this one works really great. And um, it ju it's just hold on with like four or five pieces of double-sided tape, but you shouldn't use the foam tape. You should use some tape that's like, um, um, that doesn't break apart. So it's easy to remove. So this one is really good, but um, I got some feedback on this one and some people wanted it to be round. Uh, so I made a um, updated version of this one, which is number two, version two. So this one is, um, is rounded and the whole MagSafe um, charger is moved all the way up to the edge. So if we compare them, um, it's a bit more sleek. So when this one is installed, it looks like this. So yeah, this one looks, um, I think it looks even better. It looks a lot better. Um, so nothing wrong with this one. The only downside to this is that um, it's a bit hard to reach the phone here if you want to be able to co control your phone while you're driving. Um, so that's where um, version number three comes in. This is the kind of tape that I use for these ones when I sell them. Um, if you want to make this yourself, you can buy all of the files for all of these. It's a one-time purchase and you find them on uh, Colts 3D. I'll put a link for that down in the description. Um, so let's put this one on and let me show you what it looks like. I have actually reused this tape a couple of times, so, um, but it should be strong enough. So, um, that's it. This is version number three. Um, so the benefit of this one is that um, it's really easy to reach the phone. The downside is that um, the, the bottom left corner of the, of the phone is going to be covered by the steering wheel. But I mean, if you have your hand up here, like um, 2 and 10, then you're gonna cover the phone with your hand anyway. So I think um, that's gonna be fine. It's like if you lean a little bit uh, in towards the middle, then you see, then you will see the entire phone. Um, I was considering moving this a little bit um, to the right, but it wouldn't make that big difference. So it it clears um, the dashboard with about maybe like four or five millimeters. So pretty much perfect. And before I forget, uh, if you find this video uh, interesting or useful or um, you just like this kind of content, um, press like and maybe consider subscribing. And yeah, let's get the MagSafe. Okay, so this is the kind of MagSafe charger that you will need to use one of these uh, brackets. This is just the Apple MagSafe and it has the USB-C on the other end. So, what I do is I just start with a cable, push that in, there we go. Okay, and that's it. If you wanted to, you could put a small piece of tape like in the back of here just to hold the cable in, but I'm not gonna bother with that. Okay, so this is how good it is. Like it's so easy to just um, get the phone on there and off. And this is what I like about this, but this will also allow you to reach your phone if you need it for some reason. Um, yeah. Uh, this cable here is just for a, um, a wireless microphone because the GoPro that you're viewing from right now, it doesn't really have the best audio. So yeah, doing separate mic. So I think this is gonna turn out um, really good. For me, um, I'm getting like the bottom left corner blocked from the steering wheel, but it's not that bad. It's like the part that's blocked from my view is like the time for my, until my arrival, like 11 minutes, that one is blocked. And then the speed, um, the, the, the speed limit, 30 kilometer per hour. Um, half of that one is like blocked. So it's like a little bit down in the corner, but it's not that bad. Yeah. 
Yeah, I'm really missing my uh, my cup holders right now. I wish I had them here. I'm in the process of um, um, getting rid of the pole star actually, so that's why I removed the cup holders. I'm gonna I'm only gonna have so I'm only gonna have the car for maybe two more days, four more days maybe, something like that. Not long time. So when I have a drink um, in this armrest, I typically wanna have my arm over the center of that so it's like it's in a way it makes me have to move move over a bit too much and for me i mean it works it's not that bad but it's, it's not um how i prefer to sit i really like to have the cup holders over here 